Ocean acidification is the reduction of ocean pH levels caused by oceans absorbing human-produced carbon dioxide from the atmosphere. When the CO2 is absorbed, the ocean chemistry is changed, causing it to become more acidic, which poses a risk to calcifying marine organisms such as mussel, clams, oysters, and coral. I wanted to see if I could find a way to reduce the effects of ocean acidification. I discovered that every year about 6 million metric tons of shell waste is produced worldwide from the commercial seafood industry. I also learned that the shells are 95% calcium carbonate. I began to wonder what would happen if these waste shells were recycled and returned to the ocean. I thought that maybe the calcium carbonate in these shells could act as an alkaline buffer and help mitigate ocean acidification by stabilizing the pH levels and reducing shell degradation. To test my idea, I pulverized equal amounts of mussel, clam, and oyster shells and created three seawater test solutions. One was at pH 7.5, which is the projected pH for the year 2100. The second was also at pH 7.5, but had the shell powder added to it. And the third was the control with pH 8.1, which is the current ocean pH. In each solution, I used three replicates of mussel, clam, and oyster shells. Every two weeks for 12 weeks, I measured the pH of all the solutions, weighed, and photographed the shells. My results showed that the addition of the shell powder to the acidified seawater not only slowed down the degradation of the shells, but it also helped to stabilize the pH levels over time. Even though buffering an entire ocean isn't feasible, it might be possible to create protected marine areas to help mitigate local impacts of ocean acidification and ensure the survival of our most threatened marine organisms.